another day another dollar in this quarantine lifestyle that I'm living right now I got my um, wellness wellness shot where the fuck is my car okay yeah got my wellness shot um, got some coffee probably gonna go get a nitro cold brew from Starbucks because you can still get um, what you call that take out like I said um, you just can't dine in you can't sit inside so um, yeah there's that anyway oh my god I'm so tired and I'm probably gonna need gas in my car cuz I didn't get gas yesterday so yeah story of my life alrighty guys so coronavirus update um, I did not get gas and I'm running late and I have a Thursday morning meeting as I always have a meeting on Thursdays and hold on oh sorry about that um, like I was saying sorry my phone was ringing but um, I have Thursday mornings every Thursday morning this is not a new thing I just can't get in the swing of this schedule you know being um, having to go to work at 9.45 I believe is the time that we're supposed to clock in for work or whatever it's just really taking a toll on my body at the moment um, like all I want to do is sleep and um, you know I don't feel the hype like everyone else I don't feel the um, necessary need for like you know to freak out and you know I I joke around I'm like oh let me get this mask or let me get this germex or what have you but I mean like god it is taking a toll on me a little bit um, especially on my sanity because right now um, yeah I, I just can't get in the swing of my new bedtime and it's it's get, it's becoming pretty bad it like if I do say so myself it's becoming pretty bad uh, geez and I really wanted to get some Starbucks but I just can't wake up anymore I guess so I guess I'm gonna go to the gas station and get um, <laughs> excuse me excuse me uh, I guess I'm gonna go to the gas station and get me a Starbucks uh, one of those canned coffee drinks jarred coffee drinks or what have you um, yeah just not feeling it today not feeling it at all at all I say so we'll see how today goes um, everyone stay tuned this might be an actual actually a very short vlog just because um, I really just if I'm quite honest with you I really don't have anything um, going on there's no like exciting content again we're just on lock lockdown and I'm just broadcasting what's going on day by day um, daily trying to daily <laughs> um, I guess I'm gonna stop at this shell gas station I'll show you guys what it looks like at this shell gas station I'll also take a picture of the gas prices cuz uh, y'all probably don't know how much the gas prices are so well hold on everyone stay tuned y'all guys can see the gas prices are kind of low I put only 20 usually it takes me about 25 to fill up my gas tank um, but lately um, I'm loving that I only have to put 20 because usually I have to spend $150 um, dollars a month total for my gas but now I only have to put 20 um, so that's pretty awesome Again, I still have to come to work like normal people should be going um, to work. But, um, you know, I'm, a, I'm an essential employee, but I don't get paid like one. So, and I don't mind telling everyone that I don't get paid like an essential employee because um, this coming April 8th, I believe, um, 
I'm going to get my annual review. I will be at this company for one full year. And I'm asking for a $5 raise. Now, I know what you guys thinking. God, that's a lot for... That's a whole lot of money. That's a whole big raise. You know what I'm saying? But actually... If you guys really knew how much I'm getting paid over there, you would be fucking shocked. Like, you know, um, I think that my CEO and my higher-ups don't really know that I pay rent. I don't live with my mommy or my daddy. Um, I pay all my stuff like out of pocket everything that i own is mine um like for example the gas that i put in my car um the insurance that i have for my apartment my apartment rent my utility bills for you guys who live out on your own you guys know what i'm talking about um in regards to this uh matter because I mean, y'all guys know if y'all are paying rent and y'all are paying bills that shit ain't free. Like, shit is not cheap, you know? And the prices of living is going up, yet the salary and wages has not fluctuated. Like, has not gone up, you know what I'm saying? Um, I think that's a big crisis, especially because kids my generation or adults young adults excuse me my, in my generation will never know what it feels like to well like to own a house i was gonna say to own a house um at a young age but that's kind of a lie right like uh i know some of my friends that do own a house right um uh, that have had a house or having our are in the process of uh, excuse me in the process of owning a house however um they had a lot of financial help from their parents you know and i'm just like yeah i don't have that um luxury <sighs> especially if you guys know me um on a personal level y'all guys definitely don't know that i will know that i don't have that sort of luxury um nor do i really like want that sort of luxury um for obvious reasons i think that it, it enables me and it, it it enables me to grow and learn and have life lessons and stuff like that um but yeah that's that's kind of my spew on that uh so yeah i will be asking for a five dollar raise just because if you guys honestly knew what i was getting paid like i would like to see my ceo my ceo try to live off my wage like i would love to see someone an average person live off what i'm living off right now and like be able to be independent and be able to like you know like have a second like have a social life have a have a life where they could like do things and be social and you know uh, i mean have a life that's not work because i mean even if you are making my salary technically because you're working two jobs right you have like a waitressing you have your main squeeze and your your second like side piece job or whatever you want to call your second piece of your second job um yeah y'all guys will know that you gotta hustle and there is no second life there is no life like oh i'm gonna go out with my friends no because if you're working around the clock then hell how are you going to have a second life you know, or have a second like you know like y'all know what i mean um Maybe I can't explain it too much right now because I have a lot of anger towards it and I have a lot of feelings and I'm not good at expressing my feelings which is kind of why I also decided I wanted to do a blog in the first place because I think it will help me express uh, feelings and really dig deep you know what I'm saying 
anyway, I could go on and on and on about it, but um, right now I'm driving. So everyone just stay tuned um, and bear with me with this coronavirus nonsense. I know these vlogs may seem a little boring and um, not to your liking, but uh, yeah, definitely just everyone stay tuned. I know when this all blows over, I'll really get to um, do vlog about the things that I really wanted to vlog about uh, this year, the following year, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'm going to stop talking right now because I guess I'm getting boring. So everyone just stay tuned.